Hello, today I demonstrate how to modify GoPro Hero 3 and 3 Plus. First, if LCD touch backpack is attached, remove it. Open the battery down and remove the battery inside. This front cover is not fixed by screws. This is fixed by locks and double sided tape. Use the provided cover pick to open the front cover. Open the cover along the four edges. Note, these two areas have relatively large sets of double sided table beanies. After carefully unlocking the front cover, use a toothpick or similar tools to separate the double sided tape inside. After unlocking all the cover locks on the edge, use the finger to slide press the LCD screen. And let it detach from the front cover. Now, disassemble the main board in these four back cover screws. Here please note, the screws of Hero 3 and Hero 3 Plus are different. Hero 3 needs to use T4 star height screwdriver. Hero 3 Plus needs to use normal cross height screwdriver. Now we are disassembling Hero 3 Plus. Use cross height screwdriver to remove the four screws in the four corners. After the screws are removed, slightly pull the main board and the back cover. The parts here get stuck. We use cover pick to separate this part. Then slowly and slightly pull it out. When pulled to this position, don't pull forcefully and don't let the main unit be separated in one time. This Hero 3 Plus's main board and cover are connected by a cable. Follow this angle. Slowly disassemble the main board and the back cover. After that, we can see that there is a cable connected onto the main board. We use a toothpick or similar tools to enlarge this black socket and then slide remove this cable from the main board. Now, the main board and the back cover are disassembled. If you disassemble here 3, you can directly disassemble the main board from the back cover. There is no cable between them. Now, disassemble the cable connecting the LCD screen and the main board. Also unlatch the black socket. The cable disconnected from the socket is OK. Do this process slightly and slowly to pull the cable out. Now, disassemble the FVD module. Here, 3 Plus's CCD module also need to use normal cross height screwdriver. Hero 3 uses T4 star height screwdriver. Remove the four screws and use the toothpick to unlatch the CCD module socket. Then, the module is separated. Next step is to separate the main board and the base board. This is only one cross screw fixing them. We remove this screw and carefully separate this area of the main board slightly. Because this area has more grease sticking the main board and the base board together. Slightly separate them. After that, follow this direction to pull the main board out. Now, separate the LCD screen from the base board. Push the LCD screen from bottom and slowly detach the LCD cable bit by bit. This cable is applied with glue. When detaching this cable, must be full attention, bit by bit. Each interval cannot be too wide. If this cable is torn, the whole camera will be rent. The fall must do it slowly and carefully.
now the whole camera is disassembled. Now demonstrate how to modify the camera. Here are the parts and accessories for modification. This is CCD module extension cable. This is CCD module grommet. This is filter. This is the screw pack. The remaining parts are aluminum accessories and adapting mounts. There are four types of screws. Each type has its own purpose. During installation, must be careful. If lost, there will be no spare. First medication step. Take this medication front panel. Take the CCD module out and install the grommet. Tidy the cable. Let it bend a little bit. And lay the module flat on the front panel. Take the four lunged screws and turn them to pierce through. After piercing, you can turn several more turns. These are not screw threads. The purpose is to let the screws pierce through. And then take this do not. Note the up and down side with indentation facing up, i.e. inward. Install the filter onto the indentation side of the do not. Be careful that don't let the finger touch the surface of the filter. Align the position. Remove the protection membrane. Align to the screws of the front panel. Then, slightly tighten each screw. Don't tighten one screw in full extent in one time. Tighten the screws one by one. Step 2. Install LCD screen. First, install the LCD screen. The press slowly along the cable. Then, press slowly along the cable. Let the cable run through the panel and then slightly press the cable again. Step 3. Check out the original power button and two transparent circles. These two circles fix by pressing. Push them slightly, then they will come out. Use a cutter to cut this position. Then the button separated. Install the original two transparent circles into the new panel. Press them. And then install the power button. The fourth step. Pull the two panels together. Let the tip of the CCD module pass through. Move horizontally to align the position. Tighten the two short screws for temporary fixing. After modification, they will be removed and other screws will be installed. Remove the double side tape on the base plane. Let the CCD module cable stick on it. Carefully press it. Install CCD module extension cable. Note the direction. Bend side facing upward. Align to the CCD socket and press the cable carefully. Pay very careful attention to this alignment. If don't align correctly and press it, the CCD module and the cable will be damaged. Make sure the alignment is absolutely correct before pressing. After pressing, Slightly fold the extension cable like this way. After that, install the main bolt. Push the main bolt according to this direction. 
Slightly play the guiding cable of LCD screen. Install the main port on the panel. Adding the unique white screw to fix the main board. The original screws are too small, don't need them anymore. After fixing the main board, now connect the keyboard of the LCD screen. After insertion, light the black socket. Now, connect the CCD module cable back to the main board. Also need to align carefully. Insert the tongue of the cable to the socket of the main board. This procedure must pay careful attention. Press it several times after alignment to prevent the cable getting loose. After firmly pressing the cable to the socket, the installation of the main board is almost completed. Test the main board and the cable by connecting a battery. Install battery and an LCD monitor. Switch on the camera. The LCD screen displays normally. And then look at the LCD monitor. Pointing the lens to a light source and the monitor shows changing. Then modification is completed. Detach the LCD monitor and the battery and install back cover. Before installing the back cover, first connecting the guiding cable. Light the black socket and lock the back cover cable. And then put the back cover back to the original position. Slightly press it. Align the four edges. Now fix the back cover and front panel. First, remove the two temporary screws. Slide to pull the front panel up and turn it to slide until you see the three screw holes. And then, install the original fixing screws, tighten them. After tightening all the three fixing screws, slightly turn the panel in reverse direction. Install the other screw. All the four screws are tightened. Rotate the front panel to the original position. Install the remaining four screws for the front panel. Modification is almost completed. Thank <laughs> you. 